welcome to Children of the New Earth. I'm your host, Jennifer Partridge. We're down here at the Birth 2012 Vision Stage, and we are really here to discuss the vision of the new youth in the moment now and how we're going to really embody what this consciousness is of the Birth 2012 through the children, through the youth, and through this age. The food across the world is the deepest ritual that we can all relate to because we all eat. And one of the pieces which all of the ancient cultures really integrated was praying before they eat. Mm -hmm. And there are many reasons for why they did that. First of all, honoring the creator from which it came. But also as you give gratitude to something, you become more relaxed, your nervous system starts to relax. And the food that we're actually bringing in wants to absorb into your system. And so as you are more relaxed, you're actually able to absorb the prana or the life force within that food, as well as all the ingredients that are needed to bring health to your body. So I totally inspire you at home, whatever you're up to in your world, recognize that you are are unique and that your piece is so unique to the rest of the whole that it fits perfectly into the puzzle and without you in it the whole universe the whole cosmos would not exist we've just arrived at the Don Juan tree in Ayurvedic Center for Natural Health where this 5,000 year old ancient art and science comes together to heal the body mind and soul I'm about to introduce you to one of India's top Ayurvedic doctors while I receive some treatments. Let's go check it out. Welcome to Wisdom of the World. I'm your host, Jennifer Brooke, and we've just arrived in our first location, India, where we're about to discover the wisdom of this beautiful land. Join with me as we learn about its ancient knowledge, celebrating culture and festivals, support some local nonprofits, and be inspired by a wisdom that echoes across time. We've just actually spent some time up there with the monks where we were doing prayer and meditation and we were really interested to find out what are the key principles of a Buddhist life. All sentient beings and environments all are dependent of each other. We are here in beautiful Abud Bali at the Global Social Change Film Festival, a festival like no other, that brings together inspiring films and offers us a way to create change in the world. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to massage the points here just underneath the collar bloom. Okay. This is the called the emotional well, and if you press into this point, and the audience at home can do this with us, right? And You'll start to just feel it's a little bit tender. This is where we store a lot of our emotion. And so as we work through the technique, we're going to make some deep breathing and some sound. Breath and emotion run on sound. And so let's take a deep breath and release with sound. Ah. We just feel ourselves settle a little bit more into our body. 